So now I'm going to teach you how to make uh, your own gyrocopters. Okay, so uh, from your handout, you will see that there is a pattern. And what you need to do, you need to follow the patterns properly. This is also practice, okay? So it says that um, the length is 15, so I'm going to use my ruler and uh, measure it from 15. Now, what you want to do, you see, this is the edge of my paper. Uh, in order to save on cutting, okay, I try to use both edges okay so it will save you then you only have to cut two sides okay so I look for 15 and I just put it at the very edge see and it helps you make it straight because it lines up with the line of the 15 okay so there's 15 and I mark the 0 okay 0 to 15 okay and then I just move it up a little bit because, you know, the best way to make a straight line is to have two points, okay? So there's 15 and there's the zero again. So all I need to do is to connect these two dots, okay? So I have a straight line. So I know that this is 15 centimeters, okay? It says that the width is 4 cm, 4 centimeters. So let's measure 4 centimeters from the end of the notebook. So there's uh, 4 cm, okay? So I put the zero here, okay? Again, aligned with the edge, and there is 4, okay? So 4 and I just move a little bit. Again, I want another dot at 4 cm. So to get a straight line, we just need to connect the two dots. Okay. So there we are. Okay. So this is 4 cm. And this is 15 cm. Okay. So now what do we have to do? We need to do the flap over here, okay? And the flap is, okay, 6 cm, 6 cm. So we divide it by 2 cm, 2 cm, and then 6 cm. Okay, again, I'm going to put my ruler here, and I'm going to measure 2 cm, okay? And I'm going to put a dot at 2 cm. There you go. And I'm going to put another dot at 2 cm. And then I am going to measure 6 cm. So I'm going to put 6 cm at the edge. 6 cm at the edge. Okay. And uh, I have the two dots there. There you go. Okay. So this is 6 cm. And this is 2 cm and 2 cm. Okay. And then I put my line here. You're supposed to cut. Okay. So this should be dotted because we need to fold. Okay. Now, how do we get from here to here? According to the pattern, it says 1 cm. Okay. So I measure 1 cm. Okay, 1 cm is over here, and 1 cm is over here as well. Okay, so I just put a light, a light line because you need, okay, so this one is 1 cm, and you need to measure out another 1 cm. Okay. So, and this is also 1 cm, 1 cm, okay? And you need to put in, let's look at our pattern again, okay? Dotted lines, because we're going to fold, okay? This is cut, this is fold, okay? So, we just follow all the way down for flap C and D. So, I'm just going to get my ruler, okay? And I'm just going to put broken lines or dots, whichever is easier. Just make sure you know 
okay because one is cut and the other is fold okay so I'm just putting my broken lines here okay and we're almost done and how much do we fold from the bottom it says 2 cm so I'm just measuring 2 cm from the bottom so there's two two and again in order to make a straight line okay so again uh, it might not have been on the camera but I measured 0 to 2 and 0 to 2 okay and all you need to do is to put a broken line because that needs to be fold and there you have it this is your uh, gyrocopter template all you need to do is now to cut and put things together so see the reason why I wanted you to draw it at the edge of your paper is so you only have to cut here and here if you do it in the middle not only do you waste paper but you have to cut a lot of different uh, you know four four cuts instead of just two cuts okay so there you go there you go done okay now it says cut on the solid lines okay solid line and solid lines okay and then fold on the dotted line okay so I'm gonna fold this one see and fold the other side there you go okay and then this one fold as well there you go done okay then what do we do with these flaps okay one flap is folded forward the other flap is fold backwards okay so that's how it should look like your gyrocopter should look like very easy okay so what do we do next you need to attach the weight at the bottom now some it says use a paper clip okay if you have a paper clip you can easily okay just secure the bottom with the paper clip okay there if you do not have paper clip okay you can use a little bit of blue tack okay not too much you know just a little bit of blue tack to put them together okay or if you do not have blue tack you can use rubber band okay and then you can just loop it around as many times as you want or you can use sticky tape okay to secure this portion okay so that's all you need to do to make your uh, gyrocopter okay so in the next video I will show you how to release it so that uh, it will become a fair experiment okay bye bye <music>